After two weeks of waiting, the crossbow has officially been released. Now, some of us dirty dogs might have had it before then, but now we can get it for real this time. So today, we'll be unlocking it and seeing if all of our camel progress is still there. Now, to unlock the crossbow, you need to do all these Path of Rowan challenges that have been released throughout the last two weeks. And the challenges are, at least for multiplayer, are win 15 matches, get 100 objective defense kills, get 50 operator kills using Battle Rage, get 100 operator assists, get three operator kills without dying 25 times, get 50 operator revenge kills, and 25 melee operator kills. Now, this is the most extreme level of do challenges to unlock a weapon that we've seen so far, but we already have most of them done. I've gotten a lot of these done just like grinding up camos for the previous weapons that were released this season and playing ranked play. So I think what I'm gonna do for the revenge challenges is hop in ranked play because there's only four players on each team. Pretty good odds that you're gonna kill somebody that killed you there. And then after that, we'll just hop in like dome or something and use like the dual kadochis and try to get the rest done. So let's go ahead, hop in and try to get this crossbow unlocked. Okay, thank God it's hard point. I would have been so mad if we actually got search and destroy in ranks when I'm trying to go for revenge kills. This is probably the best mode we could have gotten. But anyways, got a few things I wanna talk about today and hopefully I have enough brain power to focus on the game and talk about it at the same time. First of all, I saw a few people were mad at me that we even got the crossbow early. Uh, a lot of people were saying I'm a dirty cheater for uh, doing a uh, offline glitch to uh, make a blueprint and saying or taking like mental leaps that that would lead to me using wall hacks or or aim hacks in the future which i completely disagree with i think if a weapon's in the game and it's fully usable like there's no work to be put into it i think everybody should be able to do it so that's why i did now that it's officially out and unlockable uh there's gonna be a lot more people using it and uh i think that's good i, I think it's a really good integration of the crossbow trophy systems don't mess it up they don't take out any of the bolts and there's a lot of customization to it i think it's a really fun weapon and one of the more fun camo grinds out there and i really hope i still have my camo progress on it. I don't see them taking it away because I think this has been uh, a thing, at least the way that you could unlock it early or use it early. I think that was has been a glitch for a while and nobody's gotten banned for it or anything. But if we don't have the camos on it, you know what? I'm fine with that because I'm down to grind it again. It was a fun weapon. But outside of that, I think I've been having the most fun with COD recently during this ranked update that I have before. Like it has been so much fun. Get out from behind that door. I don't think I don't see you. Oh, and there's another one. But ranked has just been so much fun. I, I've been loving hopping on here with the boys. They've actually picked COD back up after not really playing it since like release. And this is probably the best thing they've done to multiplayer in a long time. Like they already have SPMM in the game and adding a way to see how you're going up, like giving you something to work towards really just makes it a lot more enjoyable. It makes you want to play a lot harder. Like all they had to do is add a camo for playing objective and winning and ranked for me to want to play objective. Like just give COD players more stuff to unlock and they'll go and unlock it. But the games we played have been like really intense, really fun. Uh, we've had a lot of like fun interactions with other people too. Like voice chat is crazy in there. People get so competitive and we just fuck around with them. It's, it's, it's the best. And I hope they keep this up season to season where there's like a new camo to go for every season for ranked. Like that will keep me playing. 100 games though is kind of a lot. I like that it's a little more exclusive of a camo because not everybody's going to get 100 wins in ranked. Like you have to play a, uh, a few matches a day and get a few wins a day throughout the season to even get it. So maybe like bringing it down to like 75 or something, you know, just a little bit. Make it still it's, that it's so a grind, but not that much of a grind to where people get burnt out on it. There's got to be a, a happy medium somewhere in there. And my weapon of choice uh, for ranked so far has been the TAC-56. I like playing a little long range. And I think it's the best long range option out there besides a sniper. Uh, it can't really keep up too much like close range against the Vetsnev. I feel like I lose every gunfight that I'm going against the Vetsnev with like up close and personal. But for the most part, it gets the job done. And if people are playing a little too fast, I can switch to the Vets Nev and compete with them. It does feel like those are the only two weapons being used in the game right now, though. It's all Vets Nev in the kill feed constantly. And I don't even know if I've gotten a single revenge kill. I have not played my, my best, but this is my first game on. And I do have the most time on the hard point, so they can lick my balls. This is like my least favorite hard point like spot on this map. I feel like I can never break into the upstairs area. It's always so locked down. Like, just every angle is covered. Yeah, we're kind of getting smacked around in this game. I'm not going to lie. We have not been able to get and hold the hard point since, like, the first one. And that's kind of debatable. Yeah, maybe we vet snub the rest of this game. I was just talking up the TAC-56, but we're getting boned. One thing I, I would really like to see is a little more variety, though. I mean, that guy just kind of fucked us up with a Glock. But uh, what am I going to do about it? These guys are just stomping us. There we go. A little comeback metal. Maybe that's a good omen for our team. We're finally holding these down. And I think that might be game, unless we can take this hard point back. 
And yep, that's probably game. Cool. Did I even get any revenges that game? We got one. <laughs> okay, we might have to play another one. All right, good. We got control. I swear when I play ranked, all I want is search because that's like the most fun. Everybody's always talking shit and it's all going back and forth. But uh, not very good for revenge kills. Gonna take a while to get those. This, however, we can get it done. And I think outside of search, control might be my favorite for rank. Control, it feels like there's a lot of strategy that goes into it. And it's like kind of more the laid back game mode in ranked where you can kind of just hop in there doesn't need to be like that much communication and you can just kind of just get kills it just feels like regular multiplayer just with the added live system and it seems like we're not doing too well over at b they already got four lives on us oh i stuck them eat shit and i got killed okay rank does feel a lot different though without a team i feel like every time i've played except for like the first few days ranked was out has all been with just like my boys it's definitely a lot more fun when you have a team of people to play too Helps, helps making getting the 100 wins a lot easier as well. Oh, yeah, they took this round pretty easily. I'm not going to lie. Kind of swept us. Damn. I'm getting shit on. What is he even using? The cast off? I've never seen anyone use the cast off 545 and ranked. Well, okay. You know, here's the variety I was asking for. Cast off and MP5. Damn. Uh, I'm getting fucked up. What the fuck? MP5's out shooting me from that range? Is the MP5 meta? What happened? We only have six lives right now. We're getting cooked. Oh, no. Did I even get a revenge kill that game? Okay, I just need one more. I can hop in a multiplayer now. That was awful. I was getting my ass kicked. Was it an excuse to play ranked? Sure. Did I do anything worthwhile in ranked? No. All right. Let's go hop on a dome and start working on our melee kills. And check this out. I think the battle pass is done. Sick nasty. All complete. Now, what do I get for this? COD points and an AR. Oh, that actually looks really nice. The dragon turns more gold as you get more kills. That's pretty sick, actually. Nice blueprint. Tier 100 skin doesn't look the craziest, though. I'm not going to lie. All right, let's see if we can get some melee kills. This isn't the craziest map for it, but it's what we got. Eat that. Oh, and then I'll eat that. We just need 25 kills with these. It shouldn't be too bad. The throwing knife is still flying right here. You hear that? Oh, I picked it up. They just really need, like, more small maps in this game. I don't even care about, like, Shoe House or Shipment. I know they're both, like, the best small maps in this game, but add some more. Let's get some variety in here. This sucks. I'm trying to run around here, getting shot at from every angle. The time to kill is so fast, I can't get close enough to get a kill. And then, plus, they got a VTOL up. What am I, what's the man supposed to do? Don't you turn around. There we go. That's a double. What did we just get? I just got something unlocked. It didn't even show me. The unlocks in this game also need a little fix. First of all, I want to see the camo I'm unlocking if I'm unlocking a camo. Throw that up there. Not just a little medallion. And don't show the medallion while I'm respawning. That doesn't make any sense. How am I supposed to know I unlocked something if you're not going to show me what it was? There we go. That's a double. I'm getting Avenger medals, but no revenge. I just need one more. Maybe I did get it. Maybe that's what popped up earlier. Oh! My throwing knives are still nasty. Man, do I wish they had throwing knives and ranks. I know it'd be probably overpowered, especially in my hands. But that would be cool. Especially like search. Imagine hitting a cross map and search and ranked. Should be nasty. Oh, we got 69 too. Sex. Oh, we got it done. Okay, cool. This is the most convoluted weapon unlock ever, but we just need 15 more melee kills. That shouldn't be too bad. Come here. Let's go. Oh, there's two more over here. Three more. Easy kills. That's one. That's two. Oh, that's three. Tootsie Roll Pop Owl will be fucking proud of me. Ooh, I'm a little bloodthirsty. Does this guy even know I'm climbing this? He does, but he doesn't know that I have a throwing knife. Oh, if I hit that, I would have fucking peed my pants and shit and then throw it at the wall. I would have lost my mind, but even cummed a little bit too. Ooh, cut his little cankles off. Come here. There we go. One more. This should be it right here. Let's go. All right. We got the crossbow unlocked. I'm out of here. But do I still have my camos for it? Let's see. Crossbow. It is still fully leveled. Oh, I still do have all my camos for it. Let's go. See? No harm, no foul. God don't care. I guess we'll play a quick game with it. Let me make a class for it really quick. All right. This is the class I'm using. I kind of tuned it a little bit towards like ADS and blow it velocity and a little bit of the idle aim stability just to make sure that I hit those shots. Well, let's hop in and see if the crossbow is still fun to use. I'm sure it is, but you know, just for old time's sake. Oh, wait. Shoot. The ship is here. When did this get added? Like right now? 
Okay, look at this. It's beautiful. Ultimate perk earned. Okay, kind of bugged out the UI, but we're on shoe house. It's actually here. They finally did it. The bastards finally did it. They brought back the one thing everybody wanted. Ooh, the crossbow still feels satisfying to use. Ooh, eat that. A little long shot for him too. But if, if you guys are still working on those like new season two weapons and you haven't gotten them done yet, now's the time if they got Shoe House out. It could only be out for a few hours with the way COD likes to do things. But I know some people are struggling with long shots with the crossbow. Now's the time. Knock them out. Ooh. Oh, this thing's dastardly. Okay, that might be a little more dastardly, but we're not doing bad with it. Eat it. Eat it. And that's game. Wow, that was the shortest game I've ever played in my life. We got final kill, though. Nice little one-two punch. But there you have it. We got the crossbow unlocked the good boy way now. Uh, now that shoot the ships back out, I think I'm going to start grinding some masteries again. Uh, it'll be a lot of fun to get some of those done. Uh, give me something to stream. So be on the lookout for those. But go ahead, pick up your crossbow, get your camos done, shoot the ships out. You know, it's, it's a fun time right now. There's ranks going on shoot the ships out. We just need, you know, some new maps and COD's in a good spot. But that's going to be it for me today. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate all your support. Uh, it means the most to me. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later. Also, check out my rank videos with my friends. They're really funny and I'm having a lot of fun with them. All right, goodbye.